gamers, hey, it's Cast55, and you're staying alive with Cast55. Uh, I am, once again, on a quest for iron. Uh, as you saw in the last episode, I learned some hard lessons. Lesson number one, climbing is dangerous. You can fall to your death very easily. Um, you gotta be careful, pick your opportunities to climb. Lesson number two, don't get greedy. If you're on a mission to get iron or coal or something, don't stop to try to fight people after you've gotten that mineral because you lose the battle, you lose all the resources you just collected. Um, and then you gotta wait for them all to respawn again before you get a chance to get them. Now, last time I was right here, uh, I came in and I got greedy. Inside this little, uh, whatever it is in front of me, there is people and there's noises, like there's a religious ritual. On this rock right here, that's actually two big rocks and right in the middle of it is a triple campsite uh, that come at you all at once. Now I got greedy, I picked up the iron here and there's some iron right in front. I thought I could sneak up and get it without them seeing me, but they saw me and ate me for lunch. Uh, so lesson like I say don't get greedy get the materials you came for call it good go back to camp make your improvements uh, also go back have places where you can dump your supplies because your body when you die does not stay for more than like five or six minutes and so if it takes you longer than that to get back, it's gone. With all the weapons, all the armor, all the resources that were on it, it is gone. So, you want to be unloading stuff at your home base whenever you can. So that's coal. You can start to hear the vibration of whatever is going on in there. And you can see there's an archer right there. I don't want him to see me. I just want to pick up one of these poles. I'll call that good. Get away from that archer. Away from Archer Man. Now down in this valley, you hear the throng of whatever's going on in there. And you can see the torch up here burning away. Big skull. Big boiling cauldrons on fire. Yeah, that's a that's a place for a later date. There's some iron in here I can get though, without being detected. Now, again, don't get greedy. Don't get greedy. Take what you came for. Go and call it good. Alright, that's definitely good enough. Let's go around. So as not to be spotted by the guys hiding in the campsite there. Okay, inventory. Let's repair that. Alright. My water's doing okay, my food's doing okay. I keep
keep hearing these sounds. Like really big, nasty. You see these two rocks? In between there, that's where those trees and stuff are. That's where those campsites are. You can't see. Campsites aren't shown from this distance, but they're there. And there are peoples. Lots of peoples. That will come and chew you up. So, okay. I need to get back to my base. And do something with this iron. Before I lose it. I'm just picking up sticks as I go because I don't I'm using the pickaxe to get my wood so I don't get sticks that way. If you use the axe you get sticks. If you use the pickaxe you get bark. Um, when you're chopping down trees. So it's worth noting. Uh, also worth noting if you use the pickaxe when you're dismembering animals you tend to get more hide than you do uh, with the sword. However I haven't tried the dagger yet. Uh, that may be the best. I do not know the answer to that. Um, but we'll give it a try down the road here after I get settled in here a little more. Okay, I got enough sticks, I think. Where, how many do I have? 96. I could take four more. One. Two. Three. Antelope and bunny. So let's go for. We got bunny. Meat. I don't want meat. I've got more food than I know what to do with. Oh. Hide. That's what I want is hide. One down. I want hide, I want hide. Alright, there's some more hide. Another one down. And another one down. More hide, good. Ah, uh, no hide. There's a bunny over here that I can still collect from, maybe. Ah, got it. Okay. Bones. Inventory. How many arrows did I use? Oh, a bunch. 60 so I can do four arrows. One, two, three, four. Okay, so now I can pick up some more sticks, too. Where 
Where am I? So I have 97, 98. Any hyenas? Any hyenas? Okay, I gotta get down here. So I got turtles at least, I'm sure of that. <laughs> Bones. Where'd you go, guys? There you are. I want hide. I want hide. I need hide. Man, nothing but meat. I got food. I don't need food. But I do need some water. Any hyenas around here that are going to interrupt me while I'm taking a drink? Doesn't look like it. Getting some plant fiber, whatever else comes with it, and now it's time to get back to the to the base. And if I do run into any hyenas along the way, okay, I will take them on. Because I still need hide. I don't see anything here. My little, no, crocodile. And my little turtle dudes, they're here. 
Dare go that way. Awesome hide, good. I got some more hide there. Crocodile's swinging off to go swimming. Good for him. And I am gonna get back into the base and start working on this stuff here. So, since the last time I had this game up and running, I haven't done too much. The only thing I've done is gather some uh, iron supplies and I built the furnace here, as you can see. Uh, we are gonna start our engines, baby. Okay, so now let's put you back there. Turn that on. That'll get me 74 of those, yes. Let's see, I got 21 more bark here. Let's take that. Um, put that there, put that there. Put that there, turn that on. Take that out of there. Okay. Okay, so I'm fed, and let's put our coal that I got, which is not a lot, but we got some. Put it in there. Got some more. This is my second stash of bones. Uh, I have 29. Did I get that? I still don't have it. Okay. So I need to start saving you guys. Okay. So I need a torch and a branch. Duh, you gotta put it in there. Okay, now, craft two.
All right. So we're going to start to light this place up here at night now. Yes, we are.
Okay, so now that's much better. I got me some light at night here. Um, do I have a head here? I do. Got me some wood still. Let's take you, put you down there. Let us uh, put this up here. Five, yes, to scare off any would-be hyena predators. Look at this place. Craft two, okay. Okay, so let's put my whoops. Put my coal oh what am I doing? There. Let's put my coal away. Let's put you in here, you in here, and you in here. And let's craft two of you guys and put them out by the front. So if I'm coming back at night, I can find my door. We're gonna light this place up now that we can. No more living in the dark. Gotta take them. Can't put them up if you don't take them. See anything? Now we have light. your little buddies go. I don't see your little buddies. Okay. So. Oh, there's one. <laughs> Coming back. Ah, uh, meat, bones, meat. Drop that. 
Oh, but you need to go back. I need to put that hide in here. Yes, I do. Okay. Like I say, don't get greedy, because if you die and you lose all this, you've got to all of a sudden come back and make all that armor up from scratch again. Now this place is starting to look a little better. So you know what? I think it's time to take on some enemies. Let us clear up some stuff here. Two of them. Damn. Okay, so I spawn back here. Now, listen. Take your mat. Put it out. One. Spawn point updated. Now I need to get back before my body disappears. Always lay out another spawn point before you do anything else, though. Take it all. Come on, come on, let me get up there to you. Wow.
sweet. Okay, so we got a bunch of hide. We're getting some aloe vera, which I know I can do something with here in the future. I just don't know how to do it yet. What's this? Yellow blossom. I haven't seen any of that before. But there's a bunch of it around. What can I do with that? It let me take it. So I'm, oh, there's a bunch of it around. There is a bunch of it around. <laughs>
Alright, let's go get some more little turtle dudes here. That was easy. What are you gonna give me? Some hide. Yes, that's what I want is hide. Yes. It's getting dark. It's time to go home. I say I don't know what I can do with this, but but it's letting me take it, so I must be able to do something with it. All right, time to go home before it gets totally dark and I can't see the alligator coming at me. Do 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 do. Okay, so like I say, don't get greedy. Lesson number one, get that hide, because if you have to remake that armor, you are gonna need a bunch of it to do it. So, more rotted flesh. Stone maul. Health damage, ooh, whoa. That's like a majorly cool weapon. Inventory. Repair. Repair. Oh, I need more leather. So, let's make some more leather. do I have here? Let's do... Let's let that cook for a little while. As you can see, the darkness is coming on me. Uh... Wow. I don't know what this is. A little gland. Okay. Um. Oh, I don't have any sticks. Jeez. All my sticks are in here. That should be enough to get me going for a little while.
Wow, that works pretty quick. So let's put the tar in here. I don't know what I can do with the tar, but... And for now, let's put the mall in here too, because I don't know what I can do with that, but... Inventory. Now we can repair that. How much did it cost? Two leather and a couple of iron. Cool. So yes. Leather. Hide. Well, shoot. Okay, so now I need more combat. Okay, let's do this, and you, and you. Uh, 
Okay. Very cool. This place is lit up now. Oh, no, no, no. in there. There we go. A couple hundred fiber and the bone. Okay. So there it is. I'm going to call this a episode because what we accomplished here was we got our, our blacksmith up and running. We learned don't be greedy. We learned start loading stuff at your base so if you get wiped out you can come back and most importantly every time you die you have to put down a new spawn point. Remember that because otherwise it can come back and bite you in the ass as it did me. So I'm going to call it good. Uh, thanks for watching. This is Cas55 and you are staying alive this episode with Cas55. Much better than last episode. Uh, thanks for watching. Keep on gaming.